Hey everyone, I'm Ashley Cheney with the Red Carpet Report. We're in Beverly Hills for my favorite event of the year, the Hero Dog Awards. Hi, Hi Dr. Ashley. Terry? Yes. Hi. Nice, nice Hi. to meet you. Come on in. I'm Carissa. Hi, Carissa. Not daughter. Oh, you both look so beautiful. Thank what you. a special night to be here as a family as well. Thank you. I am so happy that my daughter is here to share, here to share this beautiful moment. Well, tell everybody what you're here for tonight. We're here to celebrate the American Hero Dog Awards. Yeah, and I think American you're being main a, hero dog a little bit uh, coy here because you're being honored yourself. <laughs> Tell everybody what award you're being honored with tonight. We're receiving the uh, veterinarian, the hero award for veterinarians. That's incredible. Thank so you. tell me about your practice and, and what you do for, uh, well, you're a veterinarian. Yes. However, what, what, what I'm doing is I have uh, started a nonprofit um, charity. It's called Vets to Vets United. And we rescue animals and we partner them with veterans in need. Wow, fantastic. What a great service. So you can probably definitely firsthand attest to the power of animals on people's ability to recover and, and be part of the world again. Definitely. The, the animal-human bond or the human-animal bond is strong um, and it's healing. Um, not only for the veteran, but also for the whole family. Yeah. Well, so you get to see your mother receiving this incredible award. What was it like growing up with this woman? And did you guys have dogs growing up? She, we had three dogs, one cat growing up. It's just been amazing to be able to have such an amazing role model um, in my life. And so I'm just so proud of her and happy that she won this award and just so proud. Yeah. <laughs> And you and you have you had three dogs growing up. Do either of you? You must have animals now. Who do you who have you got with you at home now? Um, actually, now I have four animals in my house, and all of them are in training for veterans. Oh wow, fantastic! What's that training program like? How long does that take before they're ready? It takes about two years, and we actually partner the animals immediately with the veteran straight out of the shelter, okay. and we teach them to train their own service dogs, therapy dogs, or emotional support animals. Wow, that's a long process. Quite a time commitment, yeah. It, it is. It takes about two years to get through the program. Um, it's a very difficult program. However, um, it's just a blessing to see uh, graduation. Our next graduation is coming up on October the 21st, and the veterans and the dogs have worked extremely hard to reach this point. Yeah, I know I know it can be expensive. My family grew up uh, raising guide dogs, so I know how much it costs to, to, to raise one of these service animals. Is your nonprofit raising funds to help help train those animals? Yes, we are. Uh, all of our funding uh, basically comes from individual donors, foundations, um, businesses, um, and we are just so very grateful and thankful to the community because that, that is where our support comes from. Well, where can we find out more about your nonprofit? You can find out more on vets2vetsunited.org. It's our website. We also have a great Facebook page, Twitter, and Instagram. Instagram. Thank you. Well, thank you for all the great work you do. Congratulations, and have a great night tonight. Thank you. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, and make sure you subscribe to our channels for more interviews right here. And uh, let us know in the comments, who's your